Hey beauties, welcome back. What is going on? Okay, I'm just going to dive right into it today because today I'm going to be talking about my favorite Smashbox products. You guys know that I love me some Smashbox. I'm always talking about it. I've raved about their mascaras and their lipsticks in previous videos on my channel. So, today I'm just going to do a dedication completely to all the products that I have collected from Smashbox. And I'm going to be showing a few, mentioning a few, and mentioning the fact that they just dropped a whole new collection called Ablaze. And it was, it's in connection to the Ablaze cover shot palette that they released I believe and excuse me if I'm wrong either last winter or last summer it's been out for a while and I have been wanting to buy that palette because it is absolutely gorgeous and stunning but every time I went to go buy it it was sold out so I need to buy it now because they just dropped a whole new collection on it and it is completely stunning you guys like the packaging has this like ombre effect and it's just like it's red it's orange and it's just very like warm and just in your face and it's just it is just gorgeous let me just show you a really quick picture of the collection and I got it off of Instagram it is they have the eyeshadow palette then they came out with a face and cheek palette that has bronzers blushes and highlighters and then they came out with three I believe it's metallic matte liquid lipsticks a lip palette and I think that's it I feel like oh and oh no there's a kit that they also brought out with a mascara a liner and not the mascara sorry um minus that it's the it's a liner a tr eyeshadow trio and another metallic liquid lipstick so that that was also part of the ablaze collection but you guys like this collection I don't know if you can see it I will try to tilt it my lighting is probably bad it's just but this this collection is stunning and I want to get it so with that being said let me just dive into some of my favorite products by Smashbox so of course the first one I'm gonna mention is their primer their primer water spray so I have two here literally like a backup for my backup but this one was a collaboration with Nicole Concilia which she's so adorable I love her she's from New York I follow her on YouTube and she is also a big Smashbox head and she collaborated with them and came out I believe with three different scents of uh, the primer water and this one is so chill coconut as you can see it's still in the packaging I have not used it I don't know if I'm gonna use it but it smells amazing but anyways um this primer yeah it you can it's a three in one and it's a primer and a setting spray it hydrates preps and refreshes skin i use it as a regular primer and then i also use it to spray on my brushes for when i use like shimmer or or foiled eyeshadows that don't go on very well with like either a finger or just dry so i'll spray my brush and then go into the the eyeshadow and it just it gives you more more punch of the color more pigment and that I use that for that as well too like it's just it's amazing this primer water it will always be in my collection I will forever use this in my routine so with that being said let me move on I believe these are you know what I might not even have prices or mention prices to any of these products because I forget I will have all of it linked down in my description box if you are interested in anything that I show today. But I think these run for like 30 bucks, something like that, 28, 32, something like that. Next thing I'm going to mention is I literally just fell in love with this foundation, you guys, and it is the 15 Hour Studio Skin Hydrating Foundation by them. I am color 3.2, and this mess. Woo. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I'm still stuck on mascaras, but. This foundation, you guys, literally just goes on like a dream. It just seeps into my skin so beautifully. I have it on today. By the way, everything I have on my face is by Smashbox. So it is just, it leaves me with a flawless finish. And I noticed that when I use it for an eight hour shift at work, it stays on all day. And I also use the primer. So the primer is definitely gonna help 
keep this on longer so these two are just the dreams and then setting it with this and it's just I can't you guys like Smashbox just has not they have not what's the word I'm looking for they have not disappointed me yet with anything that they have dropped it's just a hit after hit after hit with their makeup uh with their makeup companies and the things that they drop is just insane i love this foundation i finally found a foundation and it's it's a high end it used to be 40 i want to say 42 i believe these foundations and they they lowered them to 36 i paid for this one yeah and it comes in a glass bottle and it it is a pump so that's also i like the pump it's really it's convenient i just pump a few on the back of my hand and then just go in with a beauty blender and then I'm good to go but yeah this one and of course the photo finish foundation primer as well this is just these run for $15 I like this is just my most of these products are my holy grail products I'm gonna say because Smashbox just for me is a hit every time you guys I just I love this and again I also use their photo finish shadow primer this I put this on before I do my eyeshadows and it just it helps it not crease not budge it keeps it on all day like these products are just insane you guys I love them this is actually the smaller version I have the larger version in my makeup kit in the bathroom so moving on I also have two cover shop palettes like I've mentioned them before these run for 28 now I have the Smashbox and the Vlada collection palette this is absolutely stunning you guys the, sh the shadows are so buttery and they go on so well they blend so easily this is just another win for me I did notice though I got this other one this is the neutrals cover shot palette I got this in a kit with a mascara and a liner and um do you see that they're almost exactly the same except the top two bigger ones are like transition and base eyeshadows and then these are highlighters on the bottom in the Vlada in the Vlada palette so yeah I was just like what these kind of look the same but they're both huge hits for me as well I have this this one the neutrals the neutral one all over my lid and then my two mascaras that I have them I have this one I've mentioned this one I've actually mentioned both of these before absolutely stunning they don't budge they don't crease they don't leave any like blackness under the eye they don't have any flakiness to it they don't leave like I'm using this one right now and my eyelashes don't feel crunchy or anything like that I always get compliments when I use the full exposure or I always get asked hey what mascara are you using smashbox right here it's a smash hit like literally so these two I have in my collection and then moving on I've mentioned these before I have the smashbox matte finish be legendary lipsticks I'm gonna swatch them real quick for you now with these lipsticks you know that I'm a matte girl it is a matte finish but these if if you're going on about your day like if you're gonna go out to lunch or something or have drinks or whatever the case may be they are going to come off you guys so with that being said I would recommend using these during the day where or even just a couple of hours where you're not going to eat anything drink anything but those are the four colors that I have the gray one is one of my favorites and right now I have stylist on which is this one right here and I've worn it before on my channel as well so these run for I believe it's either 22 or 24 again you guys sorry if I'm wrong with the prices I will have all the prices down in the description box and I've mentioned these before too their liquid lipsticks matte finish now these do not come off you guys I love these I need to buy new ones because these are completely dried out I love the packaging I like that it's a clear plastic where you can actually see the color and it is true to its color you know how sometimes you put on a lipstick and it'll oxidize and either like go a darker sh like a tint darker shade than what it actually looks like in the bottle these are true to its color so 
I absolutely love these. They stay on. You, I've had drinks with them. I've had dinner with them, and they stay on. And I always get compliments with these, and I use these together. I'll line my lips with one and then use the other one in the middle and kind of have like an ombre effect with these two. And I absolutely love it, love it, love it. I will forever, as long as they have these two colors, I will forever purchase these. The other two, okay, real honest, like honest, honest, honestly, I have the Smashbox Vlada uh petal metal liquid lipsticks they're really like metallic rose gold shimmery copper colors stunning 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 but i have to say i had a little bit of an issue it's not a big issue the only thing is with these you cannot build them up like if you have it on with one application leave it alone because if you go in maybe like an hour or two later to reapply it it got a little like creasy and clumpy on me and I had to take off the whole thing and just redo it again to get like a nice fine finish. But the colors are absolutely stunning. If that issue just doesn't bother you, then I would say go ahead and get them. I don't know how much longer this collection is going to be out because it is a limited edition collection. So there is three in this collection, but I got two of them. So the colors are absolutely stunning. I can't say no more about that. And then the last ones that I'm going to show real quick are the Self Sharpening Always Sharp Waterproof Coal Liner, which is these two. I have, whoops, sorry. I have French Navy and then like a, what is this? A, it's called Penny Lane. The one thing I like about these, yes, they are waterproof. Uh, they do come off easy with a really, really good makeup remover wipe. Uh, they don't like crease, they don't budge, they don't smudge, anything like that. I love these because they are self sharpening you guys. Like all you have to do is, is twist it back inside. You heard that? Twist all the way until you hear like a click and that's itself sharpening. These are so cool. I was just like, what? I don't need to use a sharpener with these. Like this is just, yes, right here. Yes, makeup gods right here. <laughs> no sharpener for those so those are amazing and then the other ones that i like i do have um bouncer on right now on my my lids the liner that i have is the always on gel liner these glide on so smoothly you guys give you such a pop of color i have like a little grungy thing going on in my eyes today but yes i love these as well they're great they don't budge they stay on until you take them off i love them and i also just purchased another one and it's called bubbly and then i have the black one and that one as well so you guys that is my smashbox dedication today shout out to my cousin maya i love you nana i got her hooked on smashbox go buy it all so i will see you guys in my next video i love you guys don't forget to subscribe hit the little notification bell and leave me comments let me know if you have any smashbox products what are your favorites because girl i be dying for some smashbox products you saw that line I'm going to buy it all. And by the way, I don't know how I ended up in a no buying makeup challenge. I've gone, what, 18, 18, 19 days now without buying makeup. Like the world is coming to an end. Okay. <laughs> all right, you guys. I love you. Talk, see you in my next video. Bye.